Hello, it's Dominic at Volvo Cars Melbourne. Today we're gonna to go through our Google infotainment system, which is standard across the range. Okay, so here we have our inbuilt Google system. The main purpose of this screen is to serve four purposes, your navigation, your music, your phone with Apple CarPlay, and your air conditioning at the very bottom. Starting from the top, we have maps. Uh, the car comes with a four year digital subscription. All our cars uh, in Australia come with that service. And what that allows is our comprehensive voice control, uh, live traffic with, uh, with roadblocks, and the latest uh, roads updated daily into our system. So to enter an address, it's super simple. You click on search, type the address, or you can do it by voice control, which works really well for me. Next up, we have our radio. Uh, DAB is standard on all the cars, and there's, I'd say, close to 100 radio stations are standard. The third service is your phone for calling recent calls, favorites, and your Apple CarPlay. Like your last, air conditioning, which is controlled through this screen here. Uh, fan speed, low, high, feet, face, and auto, can't go wrong with auto. Temperature, blue and red arrows. Included in the four year digital service package is the Volvo on call button. This will allow you to speak with Volvo roadside the SOS button, which will connect you to emergency services, and access to the Volvo Cars app. With this, you'll be able to remotely lock and unlock the car, uh, pre-cool or pre-heat the car, and check the charge status of your car. You can also find the car on a, on a map. Alongside this, uh, you'll have access to the Volvo uh, uh, voice control system. Here's an example. What time does Volvo Cars Melbourne close today? Melbourne closes at 5.30 p.m. We invite you to experience the technology for yourself here at Volvo Cars Melbourne. Have a great day.